All right, cool little detour, but probably time for us to get back to Masako then. Now that we have that charm. Yeah, and after that, we'll probably go to the main quest. Mm hmm. The Fool. Lady Masako has gone to Umugi to look for the other conspirators who killed her family. Umugi Cave is home to smugglers, ronin, and thieves. The perfect hiding place for a traitor. And also where Lord Shimura's pirate friend is. Why does he even have a pirate friend? It's a mystery. Yes? Yes? Do you want me to drop down? Is that okay? Whoa, this place seems very... Not normal. It's not a normal village, it's raised above. Is this enemy territory? I don't think so. Yeah, where do you want to bring me, Firefly? Yeah. You're just kind of buzzing around here. These are like Ronin. Okay, the little Firefly, all it's doing is hanging around me. It's not actually telling me anything. Hello? It's buzzing less though, so whatever it wanted me to pick up was probably around here. But there's not anything that I can see. Oh, oh well. If we can find it, we'll find it. Maybe it's below. Halt, Ronin. State your business. I'm not a Ronin. My name is Jin Sakai. A samurai? Lady Sanjo will want to see you. She's in charge of Omugi Cove. Please, come with me. This way, my lord. It's important you speak to the lady. Oh, I've accidentally started the main quest. Uh, uh that's okay, I guess. Sure. If we want to do business in Umugi, we probably have to get her permission. Hi. What? Where'd you go? Oh. Lord Sakai, this is Lady Sanjo. Welcome to Umugi Ko. Hello. I see the Mongols haven't found this place. Thankfully, no. There hasn't been bloodshed here for many years. Anyone who draws a weapon answers to my men. Your safety is assured. So long as you abide by that same rule. Now please, tell me how I may help you. I'm looking for a smuggler named Goro. <laughs> Interesting. Shimura's friend. He's downstairs, having his third bottle of sake. Enjoy your visit with him. Thank you. Come see me again sometime. I think we can help each other. We'll see. We'll see. She seems dangerous. All these men are listening to this one woman, so she's got to be dangerous. You do have a really nice view here, though. And there is a mythic tale. Oh, wow, there's so much going on here. The Six Blades of Kojiro. Hmm. Well, if we can pick, I would rather go back to... Wait, what? What happened to Masako? What happened to Masako? The Fool. Travel to the entrance of Umugi Cove. Oh, it got relegated to a different place now. Okay. Well, uh, okay, yeah, we'll, we'll come back to Umugi Cove and look around for real then, later on. Right now, I want to continue on that Masako thread. <laughs> I'm 
going all over the place. That Goro guy. Lord Shimura told me to go find him, but he doesn't seem that useful if he's on his third bottle of sake for the day. That's a little bit worrying. Where do you want me to go? You're leading me further and further away from Lady Masako. Better be something good. Ah! Oh, bamboo strike. Yes, that is good. Thank you. One more resolve. This is all we need. Thank you. Did, 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 did. Nope. Yes. Good, good. Thank you. Super helpful. And back to Masako. Hmm? I would trade you for anything. So this part of the island is so secluded that the Mongols haven't really discovered it. And even if they have, they probably can't break through. So uh, It seemed completely fortified here. And the people that were living here, they weren't regular villagers. They were all Ronin and other combat people. So that's probably part of why the Mongols haven't really invaded the place yet. Interesting. But that Lady Sanjo seemed like quite a character, even from that short conversation. I think we should be wary. Jin, over here, quickly. Hey. Masako. How long have you been here? Not long enough. You need some rest. What I need is justice for my family's murder. I'll be one step closer once I catch the snake named Umura. One of the conspirators on the list. He supplied the weapons that butchered my family. And we will find him and make him talk. Should be the last guy on the list. The last guy who's not the actual mastermind. We need to get out of the open. This way. Does he live in Umugi Cove? Omada's rumored to be traveling to Umugi. I just don't know when, so I've been camping out, waiting. For how long? Too long. We can keep watch from here. Do you know what Omura looks like? I'm not sure. I haven't seen him in 20 years. You knew him? He supplied our clan, but he cheated us. Then tried to blame my husband for not paying him enough. Was he right? Of course not. Now please, watch the road and get comfortable. We might be here a while. Then we don't have to pay that much attention. <laughs> Masako, there. Men on the walkway. They look just like him. Exactly like Omana 20 years ago. They must be his sons. Were they both involved? Nobu, hide! You're attracting attention! I'm taking the canyon. There are people I need to speak with. People you need to boast to. Excuse me? <sighs> Never mind. I'll see you in Omugi. They're splitting up. Let's follow them. See what we can learn. I'll take the left. You take the right. The canyon is narrow. Stay high to avoid being seen. Two sons. Well, what about the father in question? <sighs> Ungrateful little rat. Too high and mighty to help me do the dirty work. But when I'm rich, no doubt he'll help me spend the money. Another person who hates our clan, or the Arachi clan, because... We apparently wronged them. Hey, is that you? No, oh, feet are all wet. Oh, these roads are awful. There's a lot of beautiful flowers here. 
Not the time to be admiring them, though. Yeah. Oh, sh- <laughs> I was gonna latch onto the hook, which is R2, but I accidentally had a Butterfinger moment. I pressed in between R1 and R2, and it registered R1, which, in conjunction with jumping over the trees, was shooting out a kunai. Whoops. Grateful little Whoops. Rat. Too high and mighty to help me do the dirty work. But when I'm rich, no doubt he'll help me spend the money. I love how we've been here for like what? 30 hours? <laughs> and I'm still making this kind of mistake. Oh my god. You're all wet. These roads are awful. Okay, let's try this again. There was a- yeah, there's a swinging thing right here! That's what messed me over. Brother. Your brother's on the other side. Wait, where do I go now? Father, I've avenged our family. Oh, Old he's dead. Adachi is dead. His clan, too. <laughs> Kipe says what I did is shameful. But he doesn't remember what Adachi did to us, to you. <laughs> By morning, I'll have enough money to make up for what they took from you a thousand times over. The father's dead already. I can't stay up anymore, can I? I think I got father's a proud of me. So why wouldn't he be? It sounds like only one brother is responsible. The one that we're following. The other one didn't really do anything. We really have to go back up high? So Finally. What are you doing? Going to Umugi. Yeah, you did it in a much more conventional way. As opposed to me. Jumped on some roof. I need a drink. So I told you never to come in here. Bastard. I stole those pickled onions ages ago. I'm calling my brother. No need. I'm leaving. Not a popular guy around here. <sighs> what does he expect? This is Umugi. Before the Mongols invaded, I heard they fought. The Chinese run enough for them. <sighs> What's our end goal, though? Yeah, I'm following him. But do we want to kill him? Probably. I should find Musical. Oh, hey. Jin, over here. The one I followed was involved. He spoke of revenge against Clan Adachi. Then what are we waiting for? He's on his way to meet the man who hired him. The man who ordered my family murdered. Let's get closer. Hear what they're saying. This way. Are you ready, Masako? It's very, very, very likely somebody you know. Maybe somebody you never suspected. I want out. You're just getting cold feet. It's not right. What a dachi did to father isn't right. Our family ending up in the street. Father's drinking, he stole from Adachi. And father was always a drunk. Listen, we pull this off, and you can use the money to escape. Take your family and leave the Mongols behind. Let's get this over with. They're leaving. Let's follow. Keep low, or they might see us. Keep Bay is the good brother. <sighs> Be at the beach. That's where I told him to meet us. Old fool, be quick. 
He doesn't want anything getting out. I don't know how you sleep after that. Yeah, something was buzzing. I'll read it later. I didn't kill them. I just provided the weapons. Coward. I heard Lady Masako survived. <laughs> that old lady? What's the worst she can do? I should gut him where he stands. Not yet. What's the worst she can do? Wouldn't you like to find out? I shouldn't be standing on the same bridge as them. <laughs> They'll see you. They're running. You said he was coming alone. I'm sure these men are just for show. Oh, they're gonna get killed. He is a lord. These fools are walking into a trap. Let's wait. See what happens. It's a lord. Not right. It's a samurai. It's someone who loves Masako. I hope we haven't kept you waiting. Which one of you is Omura? That would be me. You have the payment? We do. No, Omura's mine. It's what I thought. Oh, Masako. Not him too. Masako. This ain't it. You gotta go in though. Get out of sight! Can I still do a chain assassination? Nope. Another one! Damn, the fool's dead. I heard him talking about a letter. He might still have it on him. I'll look. I'll check the bandits. See if they're holding anything. The guy didn't come. Figures, because we're not at the end of the quest yet. Hey, we have ghost dance, but nobody to use it on. Anything? You want me to loot the bandits? A letter. Regarding Omura, you are to meet a man named Omura in Umugi Cove. He means to blackmail me. Kill him. I am moving funds from Kushi and will pay you upon successful completion. This note bears the same clan emblem that was on the list from the inn. Do we not know it? Regarding payment, there is no need for threats. I will gladly bring payment to Umugi in exchange for your silence. Until then, Know your discretion is appreciated, and that you will be generously compensated. This was a setup. Whoever killed your family, Leo de Omura here to silence him. The coward is covering his tracks. Judging by this note, it's clear he's desperate for money. He must not lead a wealthy clan. Or he has no clan at all. You think my family's killer isn't a samurai? Maybe he wants to become one. Start his own clan. And he's scavenging the corpse of Clan Arachi to fund it. That would make sense. Few people have the ambition for such a plot. I can use this. Narrow my search. First, get some rest. This hunt is killing you. Until I find the man responsible, there is no rest. He can't hide from me forever. I'm guessing that's the end of this quest for this island. This region. We're not gonna get to find out until the very end. Oh! And Tomoe too. We just won't find out. 25% increase the resolve gains. Oh my god. Yes. Good. We're back in Umugi Cove. Well, that's pretty good. The Conspirator. Oh, no? Lady Masako's list of conspirators grows thin, but the person who organized the attack on Clan Arachi is yet to be found. Masako has gone to Old Sina. Perhaps she has new information. Kushi Graveyard. Kushi Graveyard. Oh, now she's over here. Okay. Flesh and Stone. Well... 
I don't mind continuing. Why don't we? Yeah, let's. It's raining today. Can we get some good weather? Hey, the next time I start a battle, I've got to remember that I've got the... I've got the ghost dance right away. Is the weather clearing up? I didn't really finish my flute song. Right there? It's kind of clearing up. Whoa. Wait, but it's it's all cloudy again. Clear up for like half a second. Where is Speak, monk. Oh my god. Stop. Where is Junjin? Masako, what are you doing? Helping this monk find his tongue. My lord, help! Masako, let me handle this. Fine. But if you can't make him talk, I will. My family is coming. Masako, calm down. I, I thought she was going to kill me. No harm will come to you. What do you know about Junjin? Junjin was helping survivors at Red Leaf Temple. But I hear the Mongols raided it. Then he's in danger. We will find him. I'll give you anything you want. Why is Junshin coming up again and again? He's just a monk, right? Does he know everything about the conspirators? What do you want with Junshin? He conspired to kill my family. Ah. He's been saving refugees. And his name wasn't on the list we found. Someone left him a note at the temple. It's identical to the ones the conspirators carried. Junshin was promised supplies for his relief camps. In return, he was to provide information on my whereabouts. It's just an offer. This proves nothing. It proves he had contact with the person who killed my family. We will get to the bottom of this by talking to Junshin. You have my word. He was last seen at Redleaf Temple. Keyword talking. Junshin, a monk. Let's go. Wait for me. Keep up. Wait. Oh my gosh, Masako, you were gonna kill that random monk. Let's go, Nobu. When we find the monk, let me deal with him. No! Remember, we agreed to talk to him. The men who killed my family talked with their swords. Masako, you will not kill Junshin until we're certain of his guilt. Your father was murdered. Did you talk with his killer? No. Lord Shimura tracked him down and collected his head. You've had your vengeance, Jin. Don't stand in the way of mine. But don't you want to know that you're getting the right person for sure? If you're killing him right away, we'll never find out if he really was a killer. Calm down, okay? Oh god. What? Enough! Bastards! Pay for that! Beautiful. You wanna come? That was beautiful. Ooh, even Masako's got some sweet techniques. We murder these people on temple grounds. We need to find Junshin. This way. Oh, the Mongols are gonna mess with our plans. Why are they suddenly here? The temple is close. And so is the monk. Oh, this might be the place that we've been to before. With a big maple leaf tree. Down.
We can take them. No, we strike quietly. Jin. Or they might kill the monk. Fine. I'll take one, you take the other. I'm actually good enough to take both now, but yeah, teamwork and all that. Shoot! Oh, Masako, you left! Masako! Last much longer. I'll guard the exits. Just get that monk. I wasn't blaming Masako, but I was pressing the chain assassination button. <laughs> I don't know why I'm listening like I know what they're saying. Does anyone speak Mongolian? <laughs> oh, perfect. Reinforcements. I need to get Junshin. Yeah, this was our place. Oh my god! Masako! Stand aside, Jin. He betrayed my family. Oh, this was in the trailer. Run! If we fight, Mongols win. Oh! <gasps> what? They already won. Masako! This was in one of the early trailers before, but I don't think the person standing here was Masako, right? So maybe they changed that. Hold on. But I think for a fight like this, why are we fighting Masako? We should be talking to Junshin. No. I think we should be wearing the, um, the color, this one. But this isn't the way it's supposed to be. You were my friend. Give me the monk. No. Masako, don't! This isn't you! Do we really have to? A murderer. We agreed to talk to him. Talking never works. You promised me. My promise is to my family. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh! I knew this place looked like a dueling place, but I never in a million years thought we'd be fighting Masako. I trust you! It doesn't have to be like this! Masako! Do you hear them coming? They are the enemy! Masako! Calm down! Listen! They're here! They're here! They're here! Tsushima needs you! Thank God. No. Oh, for a second, I thought Masako was gonna backstab me. I feel bad that I even thought that. Okay. I'm glad at least she recognizes what's important here. Oh. 
They're here. Masako. Hmm? Oh, this guy dropping stuff left and right. Huh? Whoa! This guy again with a gigantic cannon! A little bit overkill. The bigger guys first. You don't want to go? You still want to fight? Masako! Masako! You gave me your word. When I looked at Junshin, all I saw were my dead grandchildren. Their faces after being cut down. And you were protecting him. So you tried to kill me? Have you lost your mind? I have lost everything. No, you've sacrificed everything for revenge. And what do you feel when you think of Juzo? We can't let anger consume us. Or blind us to our friends. You still trust me? I do. Junshin won't get far. We can track him down. Masako. Don't ever try to kill me again. I won't. I promise. Look for his tracks. This is not a turn of events I was expecting. Oh, I don't feel like it's a controversial opinion to say that the storytelling in this game in general is probably a tier lower than other open world games like Horizon Zero Dawn or Red Dead Redemption or The Witcher 3. I think it's designed that way though. Jin, over here. But at the same time, some of these character quests are actually quite interesting. Masako, Masako's story has been... There's so much going on with Masako's story. Her servant lover and now she's trying to kill me even though we've been through so much together. It's not quite what I was expecting. Junshin went this way. But in hindsight, every single time we were helping her out finding the conspirators, you could tell that she was going more and more mad and she never let the people talk. She just straight up killed them. So this was brewing for a while. Looks like he ran into the woods. When we find Junshin, perhaps I should speak with him first. So you don't trust me. It doesn't matter. Jinshin won't. And we need him to talk. Fair point. But remember, Jin, he only needs his tongue to talk. Masako. I still trust you, but you've damaged that trust in a very irreparable way. At the end, you still came to your senses. There he is. Please, don't kill me. But still... Only when the Mongols came. What if the Mongols didn't come? You would have killed me. Who offered you supplies in exchange for information about Masako? She called herself L Lady Hana. Liar! Masako, wait. Who is Lady Hana? My sister. She was massacred with the rest of my family. She visited me oh. two nights ago. Wore a crimson kimono with a golden sash. I remember. She smelled of chrysanthemum. No. No. I never told her anything about you. I swear it. Leave us. <laughs> My sister's alive. She murdered the children. <gasps> Why would she want to destroy your clan? 
I don't know. But I am going to find her. You don't have to do it alone. Meet me in Kamiyagata. Oh my god. Somebody who loves her. Somebody who comes from a family of samurai. A lord. Somebody you thought was dead. Somebody that you were gonna avenge. That's a lot. That's a lot to take in. Kamiyagata is in the third region, I guess? Well, wherever it is, it's not around here. Ooh, that's a... Uh... Wow. Lady Hana. Hana means flower. Fitting that she smells of chrysanthemums. But... Damn. That last quest should be 9 out of 9 for Masako, right? So the next time we see... Is Masako gonna kill her sister to avenge the rest of her family? Both sides of the equation are her family members. What the heck is she gonna do? My god. Mm. Yeah. Hold on. We'll go here, but we gotta... Um... That was a lot. Seasons of War. Clan armor. Why not? Sure. Can we make the strap match? What the heck? How come the order is different? This is the fourth thing. But then... On the armor, it's the second thing. <laughs> yeah, we'll do the bigger helmet. Wow. I think this part was one of the very first footage they showed of Ghost of Tsushima. Like an E3 or something. All the leaves falling from this tree- all the leaves falling from this tree is really quite a sight. But now it's become this place of betrayal. We're okay now, but I'll always remember that Masako nearly killed me here. <laughs> is that a good memory? Well, depends on the outcome of this. After doing Ishikawa stuff and Masako stuff, we still have this gigantic chunk in the middle here, not doing anything. I feel like, uh, because of that, maybe later on we should just, like, ride all the way down. Yeah? I guess because I've been mainly relying on the fast travel points to get around to places, so... This gigantic chunk here is always the least efficient way to get around to places, right? So, just never got around to it. <laughs> 